My favorite song in this whole entire game, people. We're gonna fuck this version two of Wing Fortress Zone up the ass with this awesome music and this awesome act. It's actually one of the better acts in this game. It's it's not original, but it it just rewards you for looking outside the box. This one's really got multi-platforming at its finest because really the act itself, you can actually have multiple pathways on getting towards a goal which is the, uh, the goal sign or the goal ring later on in other games it will be the goal ring but in this game it's the goal it's the goal sign and we go all the way back Why do we need that many speed boosters? I don't remember why we need that many speed boosters, but anyway. Fly up here, let's see what's up here. Ah, uh, okay, spring. That's always good. Woo! This is literally one of my favorite platforming bits right here. Woo! I could have curled up into a ball then. That would have been nice. I don't need to hit the wing yet. Ah, that's what it was telling me to do. I think I've saved myself there. Nah, not really. <laughs> I saw the ground there. Why do we need this many speed boosters? I ask that I ask that question to myself every time I go through this little bit. I'm like, why is there so many speed boosters there? <laughs> Rocket exhaust, I think not. I am super nuclear sonic. Well, no. <laughs> if I was supersonic and had invisibility, which pretty much supersonic has anyway, but if he had su if he had supersonic and invincibility, then and you can still do that in Sonic 4 Episode 2. So the physics have kind of been tweaked in this game. As you can see, I was. Um, sort of spin dashing on an incline, but you can sort of do that in the classics too, but it's not as often. But I give credit to the developers for actually trying to think of something, like at least a couple of zones to be original. Even if that meant mixing some from the previous games, like especially Sonic 3 and Sonic 2 in this case. Which is what I do like, and the mixture of music from old games and new games. So from Sonic Adventure they had the little Twinkle, Twinkle Park um, little piece in the in the version of, I think it was White Park Act 2. They had the little remix of Twinkle Park from Sonic Adventure 1, which was nice to see. I really didn't know about it too much until I played Sonic Adventure, which was last year, actually. Which actually was, you know, was good to try it out, even though it was like I've missed <laughs> all of it by massive amount of years, like almost at least 10. Like, yeah, at least 10, so it was like 11, I think. 13. So now we're in the sixth special stage again. Have we got enough this time? No. Why? Why does it do that to me? Why? I can never get the same to get to the... Yeah. I'm not, I'm not even going to stress this point because I'm probably not going to get all the Chaos Emeralds unless I do it in my own time. Like Sonic Hedgehog 4 Episode 1, which I won't be doing 
because because um, the seventh special stage is just driving me insane, <laughs> and I can never get it. I can't actually get it on camera of me doing it. I did it like five, six, seven times, and I completely completely went out of my mind doing that. So I'll probably be able to do these in my free time. But this one is heavy on multiple um, platform platforming sections, I should say, if that makes any sense. To get through and get to the goal ring, or oh, uh, goal post. Derp, this is a, a classic game, not a, not a modern game. So yeah, I do like the multiple pathways sort of thing in this game, like being sort of coming back into play, because yes, it was in play. Ah, there we go, that's that loot trick. <laughs> I learned that just then, like uh, I've been watching a lot of people do Sonic 4 Episode 1 and Episode 2 and the classics as well, doing the loop-to-loop -loop trick, so I thought oh, I might as well try it out, see if my timing is right, and I did get it right on that time, well, <laughs> I did get it right that time, so which was a good, good thing. Whee! I just love how that one forces you to hit the spring. Ah, okay. Woo! <laughs> Loop de loos from um, Death Exam from Sonic the Hedgehog 3. Now, these are actually compulsory <laughs> to get through the level, otherwise, you're gonna die. <laughs> Take that platform. Ah, no. <laughs> I hate when that happens. No! I got all those lives and now I've got... <laughs> now I've lost two. This is why I sometimes hate this game. It, yeah, it's really, it sometimes can be really challenging to platform correctly in this game. Oh no, no, Tails, no, 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 no! Kill me, Tails. Kill me. Now I've got. Now I'm straight back to 70. Thanks, Tails. Thank you. Thank you, you motherfucker. Thanks, Tails. Thanks. You absolutely killed me. Thank you. I really, I really love that. Go die on a, go die on a fire. I do love the lighting effects with that grate there. Finally. Fuck me, old Tails. Here's Christ Tales. Come on, dude. Ow. Didn't know there was spikes up there. Completely forgot about that. Epic save for the win. Jesus, I was on my rings and thought uh, that was... <laughs> My ass was clenching. Now I know you can sort of abuse tails in this game, but you know, tails can be a bit Alright, let's do this, okay. Come on, Tails! Do this! 
Super Ultra 69 that go! Woo! <laughs> 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 oh, that was funny. Oh my god. Now, now I'm back to 70s. Thank you, Tails. Thank you. Thank you, Tails. That, that, that was yeah. very much appreciated. Alright, now Sonic time! Kill this motherfucker! <laughs> 48 rings. Why are there laser beams coming at me? Oh. You got it fixed? Dude, it only took me like, what? About, what, five, ten minutes to get through all those? I died like five times, but you managed to fix it in like five, ten minutes. What the fuck? Seriously, is there any logic in that? When you're playing this in multiplayer, especially the the two tornado sections, um, in multiplayer, you got to be very aware who is Tails and who is Sonic, and when Sonic is going to jump, because Tails is going to be there to catch you. See, in this, in in in, in ah, damn it! Oh, I got the hit. Okay. <laughs> now. But I'm not sure if you can hit him while he's facing upwards. I'm not sure. I would try and do. Uh, ah, Jesus. Bitch. Yeah. Alright, let's do this. Oh. Ah, jeez, that blistered right through my fucking ring count. I was gonna say, isn't is Tornado actually supposed to? Ah, oh, Jesus Christ! Yeah, so isn't the Tornado supposed to do that? He's in a bit of a rough situation there, Metal Sonic. I always hated this section. Look, because it does that. See now, if you fought Metal, if you fought, if you thought the time eater was bad, that section right there drives me insane. Jesus Christ, it blew up. Bye, Metal Sonic. Um, Tails, we're not flying with speed here. <laughs> oh. Tails, look what you did! You made him blow up the Wing Fortress version 2. That was my favorite Wing Fortress so far. Damn you, Tails. No, it's Eggman's creation, but Jesus Christ, Tails. You gotta learn to control yourself. I don't know why we're celebrating. Because Tails absolutely raped this thing. But, anyway. So I'm gonna take another break, so we're gonna go to the menu. I wonder if the cutscene's gonna play. Yes. Yes it is. Thank god. I love the music used here. Like, it... <laughs> and Eggman still is outrunning Sonic. Wow. Times never change from 1992, do they? Metal Sonic. Hey, go back here. Come on, get packs! Jetpacks are like cheating in this game. Uh, you wouldn't want to stop there, Sonic. 
<laughs> it's like, there it is, Tails. Go die in a hole. It's funny how I can fit both of them in there. But Eggman is the only one that can fit in a pod. <laughs> oh, I do love the music there. Look at all the egg, egg station zones. Was that the... Yeah, it was the egg station zones. That's what it was. I thought it was a special stage for a second. So I'm going to go on break. So next time... Uh, like when I get back... We'll be doing Act 1 of Death Egg Mark 2. <sighs> really deserve a break now.